Hey everyone, Rob is now here with another track review. Um, I'm jumping straight into this one because I've only flown it once and I realised how bloody difficult it was. Um, and yes, um, it's called Technical and Difficult. Uh, it's obviously on the hay bale map and you can see it is technical and difficult and I'm making a very pig's ear of it but somehow surviving travelling through there. Um, I think the guy that built it uh, it's called Crazy Pony, uh, something like that. Um, but yeah, it's, I mean, it's a brilliant little map for practicing stick control um, in very tight knit uh, routes, um, but giving you the flexibility to, if you go wrong, you can just sort of sky it and come back and try again and catch yourself. It's not like the uh, horrible, uh, like, garagey. Uh, car park settings um, which are if you go wrong you really go wrong um, and you can't recover um, the one thing I have noticed when doing this is this slalom these gates you can miss them and um, so I'm purposely going quite wide through them and just taking my time because when I tried to go narrow through round the flags I was I was just missing checkpoints and having to redo it um, and the other thing to note about this one is it is a Ooh, I think it's five laps I've not actually um, I did three laps earlier and thought that was the end and it wasn't so it's definitely not a free lap track um, and I think that's just because of the size of it they've gone with five laps and I've hit the flag um, but I would say three laps is good enough for me if you're a beginner um, this is going to be challenge challenging definitely because it is, oh it's a four lap race, there we go, I just saw the number pop up on the screen. It's, that's that's probably about right, because it's short, but it is difficult. Unless you're really good, you're not going to be flying through this, so so uh, four, four laps is probably about right. Um, it's definitely one that's taking a lot of concentration, and you can see me getting a bit messy there. Um, but it's a fun one. Um, that's why I'm still doing it, because frankly, if I don't like these tracks when I do the, the, the review, I mean, I will get bored and I will just stop the review. But um, frankly, all of these and every one I've found so far, I've not ever got bored and I have enjoyed them. So there you go. That was my actual first time completing that because it was a, I thought the first time I tried it, it was a free lap race. It wasn't. It was a four lap race. Um, and that is called Technical and Difficult on the Steam Workshop. Um, I, if the name has changed, I've noticed when I've been doing these, um, the name has changed since I've posted the video. Um, so I do link to the where I found it. So hopefully you'll find it still. Um, but yeah, that is a that's a good one. Not a beginner's one. Um, I mean, if you're a beginner and you want to try your hand at it, please do. Um, but but don't get frustrated when it just goes all wrong. Um, so I've got maybe probably about 40 50 hours in the simulator now so I'm I'm starting to feel like I know what I'm doing I'm definitely not pinpoint accurate like some of the pilots I've seen in some of the other videos and stuff but I'm definitely feeling like I know if I want to go somewhere you can see I managed to navigate that course it was a bit messy but there you go so definitely simulate is great what I would say as well if you are watching Please, um, I, I'm not doing the typical YouTube like and subscribe, by all means do that if you want to, uh, but the devs of the game need your support. So if it is a game you're playing and you're enjoying it, make sure you go on Steam and give it a positive review if you're liking it. Um, that's just me asking because they put out on the Facebook group that they want people reviewing the game and writing uh, feedback on Steam. So if you're doing this and you haven't yet reviewed the game and you like it, please review it. I mean, if you don't like it, I doubt you're watching this video. All right, but um, all right, well, good luck with that and have fun. Take care, guys.